Oh, hello, Blanca. Hello. <laughs> I hear a lot of noise. Hello, you have <laughs> a lot of people there at your house, Blanca. <laughs> hello, good evening, Diana. Hello, Brenda. No, it's the. Ah, okay. Hello, Brenda, and hello, Freddy. Welcome. We'll begin here yeah. shortly. Let me see. Okay, everyone. Hello, Rolando. Welcome, welcome. And Janani. Hello, thank you. Thank you. All right, all right. Nice to have you here. I'm working right now, teacher, but I can I can stay at the class. Okay, well that's great. That's great. As long as you can stay connected, right? That's great. That's great. Awesome. Awesome. Thank you. All right. Let me see. Hello, Juan Jose. Hello. Hi, and Edwin, hello, welcome. We have Carlos joining. Good evening, teacher, hello. Hello, Edwin. Okay, welcome, welcome. We'll begin here in maybe Good next. evening. Hi. Hello. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Okay, let me see. Happy. Carlos, Iris, also connecting, and Janari. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hi, welcome, welcome. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Hello, welcome, Carlos. Let me see. Okay, how's everyone doing? Everyone's okay? Any news? Anything in particular? Hello, Miguel. Anything that you would like to share with the class? Anyone? Before we take the attendance. Let me see. Okay, so tomorrow we finish. We finished pretty much today, all right? Tomorrow we're just going to do review. We're going to do some activities on the platform and solve any questions or dilemmas you might have faced in the platform. But today we're going to focus on page 23, okay? Which is, I'm, I'm sorry, page 24, okay? Page 24 of your module, page 24. Let me begin by taking the attendance. Let me see. Martes. Okay, I'm going to begin. Let me see. Hello, Miguel. Welcome. Abigail. Abigail. Okay, no answer. Beatriz. Beatriz, okay, no answer. Blanca. Present. All right, thank you. 
Brenda. Brenda. Okay. Carlos. Good evening, teacher. All right. Present. Thank you. Diana. Present. All right, thank you. Edwin. Present. All right. Flor. Present. All right. Francisco. Okay, no answer. Freddy's. I'm here, teacher. All right, great. Glenda. Glenda. Okay, no answer. Iris. Present, teacher. Okay. Jackie. Present. All right, great. Jarvin. Jarvin. All right. Jennifer. Jennifer. All right. Juan Jose. I am here. All right, thank you. Miguel. I'm here, teacher. All right, great. Let's see, Fabio. Okay, no answer. Rolando. I'm here. All right, great. And Janari. Here. All right. Well, all right. Let me see. Okay, class. All right, that was the first attendance. Let me see, let's continue. All right. Okay, then now that we have finished the attendance, let's read the, the topic for today. Let me see, Juan Jose. Hi. Excuse me. Okay. Describe a marketing plan. Create a short analysis reading speaking activity. Tuesday, October uh, 5th, mm -hmm. 2021. Okay. Can someone help Juan Jose pronounce this number, please? It is um, fifth. 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 Very good. Fifth. All right. Very good. So we're going to describe a marketing plan. Basically, what is on page 20, 24, we're going to finish that, that page, which is basically the last page of unit two. And we're going to create a SWOT analysis, SWOT. And I'm going to demonstrate to you what is a SWOT analysis. And when do we use it and how do we use it? Okay. SWOT analysis, which is strength, weakness, opportunities, and threats. So lo que significa SWOT, S-W-O-T. And I will show you a graph here in a little bit. And we are also going to do some reading and speaking activities, okay? Reading and speaking. I'm going to present you with some reading uh, pamphlets and also a speaking activity in groups, in groups, which, which contains a variety of questions. A variety of questions, something like this. A variety of questions, right? And we're going to do some reading, which is like weird jobs, right? Trabajos raros, right? Like out of the ordinary. And we're going to do a reading uh, analysis here, like a little short essay. And this is the SWOT analysis. And this is the page of your manual on page 24. Now, I want to ask you, 
when we do this this activity here this is what SWAT means okay strengths weakness opportunities and threats and so they are SWAT so they are the initials or the acronym the acronym of these words but we will get to that here shortly what I would like for you to do is I'm going to give you a few minutes a few minutes to remember or get your notes you remember the activity that you did where you had to present a product you remember that activity where you participated and uh, um, you had to present a product to the class you remember that I know you remember Rolando All right so that same product you are going to apply it here when we get to the SWOT analysis. Now, for those of you that didn't do it, para aquellos que no hicieron la actividad esta, when we did the presentation, well, you're going to go online and find a product and you're going to do it that way. All right, for those of you that already did the presentation, you already have your product. Ya tiene usted su producto, ya tiene todo lo que tenía que haber hecho, right? You already have everything that you needed to do for that product. So this is not going to be hard for you. No va a estar difícil eso, because you already know what you talked about. Right. But having said that, we will proceed. We will continue. Okay, can we go to page 24 of your book? And if you don't have it open, Please just look at the screen and the page is there. Can you begin reading, please? Um, let me see. Me, teacher. All right, go ahead, please. Since uh, the marketing plans, oh, this guy, the achievement of effective branding for the company. Okay, continue. Why is a marketing plan? A marketing plan important. What kind of details would you include? Okay, we are going to do this when we do this activity. This is what it means by uh, what kind of details will you include. And I'm going to explain to you this activity, but this is what it pertains to. I'm giving you something extra. This is not, this is not in your book. This is not in your manual. This is something extra that is included that i have included for you so you won't have to do the research all you have to do is give me the content but we will get to that continue please jennifer okay teacher the marketing plan is right there record of how you are going to use sorry go ahead your marketing mix. Look at the best basics of a marketing plan below. Read the question and then level each of its parts with the four piece. Okay, right. So, uh, so we have. Oh, go ahead, continue, Jennifer. The, the four, please. Placement, price, promotion, product, service. Very good. Excellent. Thank you, Jennifer. Thank you. So. Basically, we're just doing a little review of what we have we have seen, right? Where we have the four P's, basically the in relation to that, all right? It's in relation to that. Now it's not like exactly, but it's in relation to it. And I want you to analyze A, B, C, and D. A, B. C and D, all right? Now, what do you think? I want you to analyze this. I want you to read it by yourself and say, A, you get to give a product a new brand. What name do you choose? What does your product do? This, this is something that you are going to do right now okay in relation to describe a marketing plan and we're talking about a marketing plan now 
<clears throat> I know some of you have researched products, right? Throughout this unit, throughout unit two. And I want you to complement this. You get to give the product a brand, uh, a new brand name. What name do you choose? What name do you choose? I know some of you already did it with your product, Blanca. What does your product do? Uh, number one. The number one. Okay. You get to give the product a new brand name. What name do you choose? Okay. You remember your product? Do you remember your product, Blanca? Do you remember the name of your product? <laughs> I don't remember. What? The? <laughs> right. Drone. I just write it. The no, drone. Yeah. yeah. The drone deliver. Ah, yeah. oh, okay. Yeah. yeah, but exactly the name, I, I, I'm going to look to my notebook. Okay, okay. Uh, I find it. Okay, what about you? Uh, um, let me see. Who did the activity, the presentation? All right. I, know some of, I know some of you by name, but I remember. Carlos, what was the name of your product? Solar box. <clears throat> Solar box, right? Yes. Okay. Will you change your product name? No, I I like this that okay. name. Uh, All right. I so, have... Okay, so you're going to put here that name of the brand. Can you repeat it, please? Yes, Solar Box. Solar Box, right? So in your in your note or in your book, in your manual, you're going to put Solar Box, right? What does your product do? You're going to write brief. Help to get uh, free energy. Ah, there okay. you go. Very good. So with with uh, Carlos, uh, number one, he is going to put solar box, right? Yes. All right. And then on uh, number two, what did you say? It's it help to get a uh, free energy. Helps to get free energy. Yes. All right, so there you have it. What does your product do? And just a brief summary of what does your product do? All right, just very brief, very brief. Now, <clears throat> the same I wanted for all of you. If you did not do the presentation, then I want you to just make up something. Inventen algo en todo, entonces, right? Para aquellos que no hicieron la presentación. For those of you that didn't do the presentation, you're going to invent something, all right? You're going to invent something. Um, let me see. Who else was it? Can someone do number three? According to your product, according to your product. I want you to go back and look I'm at going to, uh -huh. I'm going to, to answer it. Okay. The third one, how much does your product cost? Well, um, this is the, the business there or there. I don't remember how to say empresas. Your business. The business. Oh, the company. They have to, the company. companies have, have to subscribe with a monthly payment of $10 with 99 cents. And the users, each delivery will cost $2 with 99 cents. Okay, so that's what you will write. So that's how much the, it's a service, right? You have said it was a service. So that's what, that's what you will put there. All right, that's what I want everyone to do. According to your product, all right? According to your product. When you finish, I want you to send it to me. 
I want you to send it to me. All I want you to do is answer the questions. You do not have to put A, B, C, D, no, no. I want, this is individual work. This is not like from here. I want you to just answer these in your own words, your own words. You do not have to put A and then placement or price. No, 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 yo no quiero eso. I want you to answer number one and two, three and four, five and six, seven and eight only because that was work that you did already estas son preguntas que las puedes responder you can answer those questions based on what we have done based on what we have done and what we have seen what we have heard from your other classmates you should already have an idea what to put there Okay, when you finish, send it to me, not to the group, to me. So you're going to write one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Only. And just answer the questions. I want you to be I I, I don't want like for example, I don't want you to write something here that does not correlate with the other sentences. Everything has to be in a correlative manner. I hope, I hope uh, everyone understands what the instructions are. If you have any questions, please ask me. <clears throat> If you have any questions, just ask me, okay? I have a question. All right. Do we have to write the, the question or just the answer? Mm, just the answers. Okay. No sé, la But if you are, if you have your, your, your book, And you just write it, all you have to do is send me the captura. Just send me a picture. Okay? Just send me a picture. Or if you want to write more, because it might not be enough space, then just write it in their notebook and send it to me with your name. Right. With your name. Okay, this will be activity number nine. Let me give you a look. Activity in class activity. Number nine. Individual. Individual. All right. How many people do I have here? Students. Okay, I have 19 students. So no más ha faltado uno. So only one is missing. So I should get 19 responses. 19 pictures or 19 written if you're going to do it on computer. If you have any questions, please ask me. Try to use the same product that you had when you did the presentation. But if you want to use another product and look online, you can you can do so. If you so choose.
Yes. Still the product from the web. Yes, it could be a product from the web. But if you're oh. going if you're going to use a product from the web, what what I mentioned earlier is is, is try to be everything related to that product, okay? All the answers should be related to that one product. Okay. Okay. So if you choose a product, give me an example, Freddy. What product did you choose? I'm looking for it right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <yes. laughs> All right. So if you choose a product, for example, I'm going to give an example. If I choose, um, what? Uh, I mentioned, what? Dell, right? Wow, back. I mentioned Dell as an example. I'm going to use it again. So I'm going to stay with that product. No voy a ir después para buscar Pepsi, Coca Cola. No, I'm going to stay with Dell and I'm going to answer the questions. So what um, what product name? Dell, right? Uh, what does your product do? It's a computer. I mean, a laptop or a computer for for uh, everyone to use at home or at work or at school, right? And then how much does it cost? I give a cost. Everything Teacher has to be... Food. Excuse me? It can be food. Yes, it can be food. But you have to answer all the questions that relates to that one product. So where it says right here, number seven, how will you advertise the product? Then you give how, how you will advertise. Who is your target customer, right? Okay, All right, so everything has to be in relation with that product. Okay, Freddy's? And, um, okay. All right, so you can't be like talking about um, Dell, like I can't talk about Dell and then talk about who is the target customer and say like, for example, uh, children of six months, right? I, you know, I have no connection. There's no connection there, right? unless I'm talking about baby products, right? I cannot add something different. In other words, stay with the topic. I'm looking right now. I remember I saw on, I think it was on Discovery or National Geographic, I remember. It was a car that moves with a recycled oil instead of, instead of gas. That I think it's from South America to North America, but I can't find the, the video yet. Okay. Well, try not to take too long because you only have about seven minutes to finish. Okay, I'll do it the first if can. All right. Well, I'll find another product. <laughs> yeah, it's going to take you. Try not to take too long because we will. Um, okay, let me see. Abigail, all right, you already finished. Okay, great. Some of you already finished. Awesome. Let me see, I have here. Okay, Fabio. Okay, great. All right, I have. Okay, thank you, Rolando. Thank you, Abigail. Thank you, Fabio. All right, you have about maybe five more minutes. Five more minutes to finish. It shouldn't be that complicated because we already saw pretty much everything pertaining to these types of questions. All right, I just got another one. This is from Diana. Okay, Diana, yeah.
Remember, if you want to do the A, B, C, and D, it's optional, okay? If you do it, that is fine. If you don't, it's still okay. It's related to the four Ps, but if you did it, if you did it, great for you. For those of you that already finished, can you just take a screenshot of this next part? Let's see. This right here? Can you see it, Diana? Fabio? Teacher, sorry. Could you please uh, set the last image? Just one second. Okay. Yeah, I need to do the questions too. Okay. I need one question. Thank you so much. All right. Okay, Edwin, very good. Okay. Okay, Jackie, can you hear me? Yes. Okay, I understand. Remember the instructions that I mentioned were that if you didn't participate in the presentations for you to look for a product or invent, them, invent a product and fill those out okay you still have to okay. do this activity okay, okay jackie all right yes thank you all right let me see Okay, Blanca, thank you. Juan Jose, all right, great. Francisco, okay. Mm. Bueno. Part of it, right? So at least you send me part of it, Francisco. Okay, you have maybe about one minute, one or two more minutes to do this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, nine. Only nine, only nine uh, of you have sent it to me. All right. That's about 48% of the class. Okay, thank you, Miguel. Okay, thank you, Flor. <laughs> okay, Flor. <laughs> I read your message. All right, let me see. Mm. 
Okay, Jennifer, thank you. Thank you, Iris. Okay, Jarvin, thank you. Okay, Freddy's. Okay, Beatriz. All right, thank you. All right, class, we're going to continue. If you haven't sent it, you can send it to me later. All right, you can send it to me later so I can, so I can write it down. All right, this is this was activity number nine. Okay, let's continue with the next topic. Now here is what I was telling you about the SWOT analysis. Okay, this is what we call SWAT, all right, SWAT, SWAT, which is basically what you see there on the screen. Can someone read it, please? What are the, what does SWOT stand for? Let me see, Fabio. Yes. Can you tell the class what is SWAT? So, uh, it's a strengths, weakness, opportunities, and threats. All right. Weaknesses. Weaknesses. Excellent. Very good. Weaknesses, right? Debilidades. So, that is what weaknesses and strengths are already the opposite, right? And opportunities and threats. What is threats? What does that mean? What does that mean if I tell you threats? What is that? Amenazas. Very good. It is. Thank you. So we have strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, and and threats. Threats. Now, this goes. I want you to analyze this. This you're going to have a little bit more time. If you ever do, if you ever do a business plan. If you ever do a business plan, I know I've done some myself and I have incorporated a SWOT analysis, right? This is important if you ever start a business, okay? Getting empezar un nuevo negocio propio, it's good to always do a SWOT analysis, right? A SWOT analysis. Why? Because it's part of every business plan. It's part of every business plan. It has to be done. Now, some people might not do it, but academically speaking, in an economic perspective, in the business world, this is important. This is important. Now, if you ask me, teacher, if they actually know this, yes, I have. Yes, I've done some, whether it's through classes or for my own for my own purposes. I have done SWOT analysis. So it's time for you to give a little bit of practice and become familiarized with this analysis, all right? With this analysis, it's called SWOT analysis. Let's look at it. We have internal and external. Internal, we have the strengths, and weaknesses. Let's read, please, 
Mm. Miguel, strengths. Okay. Solid customer base. Diversify with presence. 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 Pre presence. Cash reserves. 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 Very good. Okay. Excellent. So these are just a basic fundamental maybe elements. All right. We can call them elements. We have solid customer base, diversified web presence, and cash reserves. Cash reserves. These are just some examples. All right. Some examples. I don't want you to fully analyze this. I just want you to just, just to look at it and hear me, and then you will do it on your own. Okay, but first I just want you to give me the utmost attention because this is critical. This is like the last point of this topic, the strengths. ¿Cuáles son las, las, esas fuerzas, esas fortalezas? In your product, in your product, or in your company, or in your service. Okay. How a less competitors maybe could be. Excuse me. Uh, how a less competitors. Okay, having less competition, right? Less competition. Okay, that could be a strength, right? That could be a strength. Less competition. Okay. Yeah. All right. For example, if you're the only one in the market, right? El único, right? You're the only one selling the product, right? So you have all the population, all society looking at your product, right? Yes, Carlos, that could be a strength. Oh, absolutely. Okay. Now let's look at weaknesses. Beatriz, can you read, please? Weaknesses. New sales team. Lack of, lack of experience. With social media presence. 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 Excellent. Very good. So this is, these are just examples, all right? These are just examples. Weaknesses, la debilidades, weaknesses. New sales team. For example, if you're trying to sell your product, but you have a new sales team that really lacks experience, that could be a weakness, right? Esa puede ser una debilidad para algunos, right? where the whole personnel is new and you have a lack of experience, right? Lack of experience. And then you have weak social media presence. In other words, not too many people are looking at your Facebook, right? Or not too many people are looking at your Instagram. So you don't have enough presence, presencia, right? Not too many people are visualizing it. That could be harmful. Como pueden ver aquí dice harmful. Right, and it's a weak, it's a form of weakness. Let's do external. Ex external. Go to Edwin. External opportunities. Okay. Uh, ex expansion into European market. Okay. Expansion. Expansion. Expansion, okay. At current competi competitors. All right, competitors, competitors. Uh, co competitors. <laughs> All right. It's kind of, it's kind of confused that. Yeah. That, now, that word. if you say, if you say, slowly, competitors, 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 right? But competitors, you, competitors, competitors, competitors. Okay. That's all. Very good. Very good. Acquiring. Thank you competitors right and expansion into european market these are opportunities right these are just examples expansion right it's like okay we're not going to sell the product just here in el salvador we're going to expand into the european market or in the mexican market or united states market or in the asian market right that's those are opportunities right what opportunities does your product have or service? Acquiring competitors, right? It could be what some people 
say, you know what, the competition might might say, you know what, let's do uh, let's unify and let's try to work together, right? Como dicen aquí, afiliados, right? And you have different cards, for example. How many of you have have a, a the card of discount for Brazil or Farmacia San Nicolas? How many of you have them? Or Crazy Man? Any of you? Nobody? Nadie tiene? Nobody? Mm, what about um, Tarjeta de Credito or Debito? Nadie tiene? Nobody has yes. any? All right. Now. Yes, I have. Yes, I have. All right. Very good. When you use your card somewhere, they give you some discounts, right? Some of us never yes, use yes. them, right? I use them, right? I use them. If you have the La de Brasil for $2, you can go get discounts at different places and just show the card. Aunque nomás, nomás enseñarla. That's all you have to do. The IFP card. How many of you have it? You can get discounts. You can get discounts. I've used it. I've used Crescima, uh, Brazil, Farmacia. I've used them in anything that I can use them for, for 10% discount, uh, a las panaderías or whatever. I use them. Some of us have them. Algunos la tenemos y nunca las utilizamos para descuentos en otras, en otras tiendas. Right? Yo des I have downloaded. Yo he descargado todos los afiliados a esa tarjeta. And when I go somewhere, I'm like, hey, I have that card. Aquí está el 10%. In, every, in restaurants, in uh, panaderías, or different stores, even with doctors or x-rays. Could you recommend us, could you recommend us some, something? <laughs> okay. Uh, like for me, what do I use? Like for yes, example, for example, I have Credit Simon, right? But when I go to, has any of you heard of Lorena? La Panaderia Lorena? Okay. With Credit Simon, no es que estás pagando con la tarjeta de Credit Simon, sino que nomás le enseñas que tú tienes la tarjeta de Credit Simon. Y automáticamente te dan 10% de descuento. Cuando uno va a comprar los pasteles para cumpleaños, I go and I pay in cash, right? Let's say I pay cash. And the cake is $12, right? The cake is the $12, right? Or $15, right? And I tell them, hey, I have my credit man right here. He said, I'm saying, okay, 10% discount. Ya tengo el descuento. Me dan el 10% ahí, pum, pum, pum. Que es un dólar y 20 centavos. Ahora, todos dicen, ya, pero es un dólar y 20 centavos. Pero ¿quién te va a regalar un dólar y 20 centavos, right? It's the gas. Right? the gas. The gas cost. The in different, let me see, in different places, a gas card. I don't have a gas card. Lo que sí les recomiendo algunos, I will recommend this, right? ¿Quiénes quién quién ponen gas en la Texaco? I, I, okay. I, I, I like to, to, to pay. Okay. Exacto, and I have some application. Ah, usted usa la leal. Yes. yes. Ah, yes. right, very good. Me too. Me too. Right? So, this now is Now with the chivo. Yeah, with that with that one you can get 20 what? 20 cents per gallon cents. discount, right? But Yes. Yes. Digamos que las personas que no tengan chivo, por ejemplo, right? Just an example. You can use leal. Es gratis. Mm -hmm. The application, right? I've had yes. it for what? Más de dos años llevo con esa application, right? And this year, and I wait till Christmas. Check, mm -hmm. my, check out my analysis here. For the turkeys. Yeah, the right? Turkeys. So, yeah, so I use all that. And at the end of the year, ya viene diciembre, right? For December, <laughs> I use up all, everything that they do, everything that they get promotions, I go and get, right? Right now, ahorita mismo les puedo decir, I'm, I'm opening my app right now. How much do I have right now in free gas? Let me see. I have accumulated. Let me see. For those of you that have it, right? I have right now, tengo 
8 dólares con 5 centavos de gasolina acumulada. So when December comes, cuando venga diciembre, ya no tendré 8 5, right? Con todas las que recarga eh, the other gas that I will be getting. So I should have about maybe 10 dollars in gas. Free gas. Free gas. So I just go and I tell them, hey. Nobody tell me about that. And I go and tell them, hey, I have 10, and they give it to you for free. Ya lo hice el año pasado, and I'm going to do it again this year. All right? So those are just, you know, who's going to give you $8 of gas? Nobody. Gas is expensive, right? So you have to be smart in, the, in economics. So that will be another advice that I'm giving you. If you put gas, ¿por qué no recibir algo al final de año de gastar tanto gas en todo el año, right? For those of you that have a car, right? Just, just my advice. Okay, let's continue. Those are opportunities, right? That's what we put opportunities. Threats. What is threats? Um, Rolando, can you read threats, please? Okay. Threats. Emerging, emerging, emerging competitors lack of differentiation All right. <clears throat> and, gover and government regulation. Very good, very good. You have emerging competitors, which is basically a threat for some, right? For example, when Hugo first came out, emerging significa que de la nada, boom, sale otra, right? That's what emerging means, all of a sudden, right? Emerging competitors. What competitor emerged after Hugo? Uber, Uber Eats. Okay, another one. Can someone give me another one? Pedidos ya. Pedidos ya, right? Very good. And Uber, Uber Eats, Eats, right? Uber Eats was after Eats. from Hugo. All right, okay, great. So those are what Not you call... Sir. All right, so that's what you call emerging competitors. That is what is referring to emerging competitors, right? It's like when I told you before, a good example was when, when um, Bidri opened open up here in San Miguel, right? Boom, Freon pop like a month later, right? Building a new Freon a few miles away, right? Those are emerging competitors. Lack of differentiation. What does that mean? Do you remember from the previous vocabulary? What, the, what did that mean? Can someone remember in your notes? Someone remember from unit one? What does differentiation or differentiate mean? Unit one, maybe someone can remember the vocabulary. Let me give you a few seconds. Who can find it? Who can find it? This. Anyone? Okay, remember that on unit one on page 10, there were some vocabulary words there, right? Differentiate, which is basically lack of differentiation. In... I have it here. Ah, okay, go ahead. Thank you, Edwin, go ahead. Tell us. Okay, uh, appeal, grow, the, the, the differ, differentiate, discontinue. Okay, but I'm talking about this word right here. Edwin? Dif ah, okay. Oh, you're talking about this one. Yes. All right. What is related no. to the one you just mentioned? Differentiate. Okay. Differentiation. Differentiation. Oh, buy out? No, no, it's buy out. No, no. Okay. Right. I'm wrong. Sorry. All yeah. right. Anyone? I, I have some um, for me. Differentiate. Mm -hmm. It's become different, the product become different during development, developed. 
Very good, very good. You become different. That's very good, very good. Thank you, Edis. Right? <clears throat> so basically here, lack of differentiation, you know, it is mentioned about the product, right? Try to be different than the other competitors. And also is setting yourself apart. In other words, you have you are unique. Usted se separa de los competidores. You separate yourself. Okay, from competitive through specific elements, price or quality, right? So you, you lack that. So eso puede ser una amenaza cuando uno no tiene esa fortaleza. When you don't have that, that positive outlook, when you lack. ¿Se acuerdan lo que les dije que era lack? You remember what lack means? Absence. Eh, falta de. Falta de. Falta de. Very good, right? So, es falta de, y lo que dijo Iris, right? Where you, you're not able to distinguish yourself or separate yourself from competitors, right? You like become involved just like everyone else, poor service, poor product. So therefore, that is a threat to your external business. External means las fuertes mayores afuera, right? So you become like, the same, right? De lo mismo. That's what it means. When you lack differentiation. O sea, que no se separa usted a ser unique, a ser único, de calidad, de producto, all right? Or service. That's what that means. All right, government regulation. Government regulation. That could be a threat. Now, hmm, here, in my point of view, this is my point of view, okay? This is my point of view. My point of view throughout the years, right? Not that many years, no mucho años, right? But a few years that I've been here in El Salvador. And from where I have been in the past, right? When I was young, there are a lot of people or a lot of businesses that do not pay taxes, right? And that is true. I can much say that I see ten razón, teacher, right? And that includes even doctors. That includes even doctors because I have gone, I have taken my dad, I have taken my dad to see a doctor, different doctors in private hospitals, private hospitals, y a veces no me dan el recibo, right? You just pay cash and they don't give you a receipt, right? When people don't give receipts, cuando hay personas que no dan recibos with sales or something like that, it's probable, es probable, it's probable that they're not paying taxes, okay? Los impuestos, that's what I'm referring to, all right? And sometimes there, since this is an English, basically in English standards, American standards, government regulation refers to intervention for example when government comes in the united states i'm going to go to the united states now if you have a company ustedes tienen una empresa o cualquier negocio en estados unidos in the united states and for the minimum amount you do not pay taxes they will come van a llegar and they will audit your company or your business and if they find any irregularities, they will close it down. La cierran o le dan oportunidad de pagar. But usted queda fichado con el gobierno federal. All right? So that's what it means by government regulations, where you have to pay a lot of taxes to the government, especially in the United States. All right? So that will be a threat for some right some companies in the united states after two years if they do not progress they close or they file lo que se le llama for bankruptcy right bancarrota right that is bankruptcy so that is something to to understand and analyze okay now with this SWOT analysis i want you to apply it Quiero que lo apliquen. I want you to apply it to the product that you just did. Al producto que usted acaba de hacer. To the product that you just did. 
which was the previous activity. This one. I want you to apply it. And I want you to use your own critical thinking. You're going to apply it to this product. Okay, Freddy, did you find your product? You did, right? You sent it to me, right? And your product was... Let me see. Was Facebook sunglasses. Okay, Facebook sunglasses. All right. So now, you are going to use your product and you're going to put your strengths. What is the strength of that product? ¿Cuáles son las fortalezas de ese producto? What are the weaknesses? What are the opportunities? And what are the threats? Right? What are the threats? Would it be like when the, like yesterday, Facebook, Twitter, right? What was it? Yeah. Facebook and uh, I mean, uh, Instagram and, 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 WhatsApp. and WhatsApp, right? They offer, that could be a threat, right? If you're doing business and all of a sudden you're like, hey, right, my business corre con esto, right? It runs with this, right? So you you decide, right? Or for example, there's no sun, right? <laughs> well, it's kind of tricky though, because in threat and weakness, sometimes it's kind of similar. Exactly, exactly. But remember, one is internal. Recording, it's on internal, right? That has to do with you. Right? How are you managing that product? And then you have external factors, like like I mentioned earlier, right? The the connection for the for the WhatsApp and Instagram, no era internal, right? It wasn't your phone or your internet, it was external. It was external factors, the satellite or whatever it was, right? Look at that. Now, any questions? Any questions? You're going to do this. You can take a picture of it, but yeah, it might be hard to find a weakness for it. All right, you're going to put your own. These were examples. Esto no yeah. eran ejemplos. You're going to create your own for your product, for your product, okay, for your product. This cash reserves means that the company or you have enough money to. And you have enough money reserved just in case anything goes wrong. That's what cash reserves mean. Our reservas. All right. Any questions? I'm going to give you. All right. This will be. This will be the last activity relation in relation to business and marketing and everything else. Okay. We are finished with unit two. This will be activity number 10 in class individually. One more time, these are examples. Do not use these, all right? Maybe one at the most, but these are just examples, all right? Create your own, your own unique answer related to your product or service, I'm going to get in service. ¿Cuántos quiero en cada, cada bloque? How many do I want in each block? I want three, 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 and three. Three strengths, three weaknesses, three opportunities, and three threats.
Ok, Glenda. Glenda. Hi, teacher. All right. Yeah, I read your message. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. You can get discounts at Wendy's, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right. And Mr. Donut Gun. Yeah. FP Confia card. Yes, you can use them, right? Ya que yeah. tienes el dinero ahí, hay que usar la tarjeta, agarrar descuentos. Right? Yes, that is correct, Linda. Yes, Thank you. Correct. When you finish, you will send it to me. Okay, please send it to me. I just want to ask a question. Aquí no más de relación a business or inversiones. Has anyone ever bought SHIB? La, la criptomoneda SHIB. S-H-I-B. Cuesta como menos de un centavo. <laughs> has anyone ever heard of it? Nobody has bought it? No. Okay. Oh, what is the name? SHIB. S-H-I-B. No más estoy viendo aquí la, la, tengo, I have a Binance, right? Tengo una cuenta de criptomoneda, se llama Binance, la aplicación en, en Inglaterra, allá en Europa. En, más si alguien tenía algo invertido allí, se duplicó. So, si usted alguien haya metido unos mil dólares, a tener ahorita los mil y fracción. So, ahorita estoy viendo mi, mine went out 50%. 50% increase de lo que yo había invertido. Ya me aumentó 50%. That's, so good, right? Yes, that's good. So if it ever goes to, si algún día llega a la dollar, esa criptomoneda, eh, I, you will see me flying to other countries and all over the world. <laughs> I'll, be yeah. I'll be rich. I'll be rich, right? I'll be rich. Yeah. <laughs> I hope so. There, right? Like the people, we that, people that invested in in Bitcoin, all those people that invested in Bitcoin when it first came out, I think it was costaba centavos la Bitcoin when it first came out. Yeah. yeah. Now, uh, all Salvadorians have uh, thirty dollars. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So now the uh, that I, I would like to buy some more. You can do it. A good investor. Yeah, if you want to, if you want to invest, you can use Binance. You utilize to Binance, right? I also have the other wallet here, but yo ya había invertido antes, right? No, no con la de aquí hubo acaba de salir, pero antes, before. So I have bought. Strike. No, that's strike. Antes que saliera todo eso. Binance. Se llama Binance. Binance. Yeah. So Binance, I, we this is Forex. It's yes, like it's Forex. similar. Yes, yes, correct. That is correct. So mm -hmm. I have bought uh, three three types of coins. 
I bought Bitcoin, Dogecoin, and SHIB. So, ah, there, I, there's a lot Dogecoin of Dogecoin in, in Ethereum. Ethereum. Yeah, the Ethereum. The people say that it's the better. The better. Hola, uh, they have the other one. Uh, mo, um, another one. Bitcoin, Ethereum, X, XRP. XRP, yes, that one right there. Dogecoin. Yes. That's cool. I think oh, yes, I have that one also. So, wow, everything has gone up, right? So, look for new new coins and invest in them if you can. Remember, you can do it through the bank, all right? So, if you have, I did it through Banco Agricola. So, just with my bank account, I connected to Binance and I did it through there. Yes. But if you ever invest, this is my advice, okay? You have to be attentive of the market. Tienen que estar bien atento al mercado internacional. You have to be. Try to check it every day. So if you ever decide, right? This is just for some, right?
Ok, Fabio. Okay, let me ask you something, Fabio. Yes. Okay. On your weaknesses, you put cash reserves? Yes. Uh, can you tell me how would that be a weakness if you have money? Because if we, no, I mean low cash reserves, maybe. Ah, okay, because you put cash reserves. Same thing that I have here on my screen as a yeah, string. I mean to be low cash reserves. Ah, okay, yes, all right because yeah <laughs> okay now it makes sense but when when you send it to me say it's a cash reserve that's what i was asking all right now it's clear teacher teacher yes. how can i say alto consumo de energía eléctrica it's high consumption of energy or high energy consumption that would be it High energy consumption. Thank you. Okay. Okay, Blanca, there you have it right there. Sorry, teacher. I wrote it for you on the screen. Ah, thank you. All right. Who has used strike? I have a question for the class. Who has used the application strike? In somebody? Here I tried, but when the app uh, required my identity, uh, I upload my document, but they never approve my document mm. so that's why i didn't continue with the app okay because i have it but i've never used it right because they don't have strike here in san miguel right only i think in la libertad and in certain places by the beach right so I downloaded Strike just in case whenever I go, I take my little tours around the country, right? And then I have plan to use it if I go to La Libertad or something, right? El Tunco or something like that. But I was asking if anyone, I heard that they had commissions, right? They charge commission. And that's why I was asking, right? That's and you I'm didn't asking. have problem with your verification account? No. No, I didn't. Okay. So you have the other one, Abigail, Chivo? You use Chivo? Yes, I downloaded a few weeks ago. And now I see the, how can I say, ganancia? Earning? <laughs> yes. The gains, right? Yes, right? Gains. Yeah. I. 
I've used it also, right? I had trouble with it Sunday. Sunday, I couldn't use it for some reason. I don't know if it was because of, I don't know. I couldn't use it. It was like, I couldn't, I couldn't make the transaction. But I used it today. So it worked fine. <laughs> it worked fine. Where, where did you use it? I went, uh, I went to Papa John's. Oh, and how is it, the experience? Oh, it was fun. It was, it was like, this is like, this was my third time that I've used it, right? So like I mentioned a while back about pizza, I like Papa John's, right? And well, here in some area. So I, I went today and I said, well, I want to go eat some some pizza and I went and it's quick. It's faster than using a credit card. Yeah, it's faster. You don't have to touch anything. In other words, the other person doesn't have to touch you. You don't touch no money, nothing. It's just bloop, bloop. You with a QR, right? It says Canel QR, el QR. That's it. And you enter your pin and you press OK to send and finish. Seconds. Quick. Do you do transaction when Bitcoin goes down or go up? When it goes up and down, <laughs> you can go to, I tried the other day, like for example, when it goes up, right? You go transfer it to cash. You said. Right? Yeah, you transfer it to cash, right? And then uh -huh. when it goes down, uh, you buy again, right? And you get those earnings also, right? That's how you have to do it if you keep you keep your earnings right uh, but the one i use in binance the one for binance no i don't do it like that that one's long term i don't touch it that one i leave it i don't touch it because i have more money in that in that uh in that platform so i just yes. leave it alone i just leave it alone and and i just watch and watch how it goes up 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 and I'm going to wait probably five years, right? Maybe it's 10 okay. years and then say, okay, it's time <laughs> <laughs> to gain, right? right? To make, because if we wait for IFPS here, I deal. <laughs> right? I, <laughs> I won't be able to live off of that, right? I won't be able to live off of that. I can live off investments. I can do that. But I, won't, I can't live off I have to pay and all that. They are living off of me. <laughs> off of everybody. That's what they're doing. Yeah. <laughs> but let me see. Teacher, I, I already sent you my homework. Okay, you finish the SWOT analysis. All right, I'm going to give everyone like maybe two more minutes to finish. And if I you don't you. finish, you. okay, Fabio, I see you have corrected yours. Thank you. All right. I will check them after class. Okay. I will check all of them just like I do everything else as an activity, porque lo tengo que anotar como actividad. All right, the class. So once I check it, I do, I will send it back to you and give you my, my ideas. Okay, Abigail, thank you, Juan Jose, thank you. All right, so you have about one more minute and what we're going to do next is do a reading activity and we're going to disconnect just a little bit with business topics and marketing and I think we have had two weeks of that we're going to do a reading uh, stories and speaking speaking with your classmates all right with your classmates so you have about one more minute to send it it's uh, everyone is here right now estamos la clase completa we are complete 100 percent 20 students all right Let me erase this. All right. Okay, class. 
I'm going to do the second attendance and we will begin the next activity. So while we do that, let me share screen. And you have a few questions right here. You're going to do this as a group. So let me make it bigger. All right. Can you see the screen class? Yes? Yes. All right, great. All right, let's begin. Yes. All right, Abigail. Present. Okay, thank you. Beatriz. Present. Okay, thank you. Blanca. Present. Thank you, Brenda. Okay. Carlos. Carlos. Yes, teacher. Right. Thank you, Diana. Present. Okay, thank you, Edwin. Present. Okay, thank you, Flor. Present. All right, Francisco. Present, teacher. All right, great. Freddy's. I'm here. All right, Glenda. Present. Thank you. Iris. Present, teacher. All right, thank you, Jackie. I'm here. All right, great. Jarvin. Present, teacher. Thank you, Jennifer. Present, teacher. All right, Juan Jose. I'm here, teacher. All right, great. Miguel. I'm here, teacher. All right, thank you. Fabio. Present. All right, great. Rolando. I'm here. All right, and finally, Janari. Janari? I'm here. All right, great. All right, class, I'm going to... I'm here. All right, great. I'm going to put you in pairs or maybe in trios, and I want you to do this activity as a group, this is a reading activity only, all right? I'm going to send this to the group so everyone can have it and then you can share a screen. Let me go to the group. All right, let me see. All right. I don't like the way it came out. Teacher. Yes. I'm going to send it to the group so you this can is, see. This is exactly five questions or are there any more? No, there? only five. Only no. five. Only five questions. All right. Let me see. Breakout rooms. All right. This you will not send to me, okay? This is just for you. No necesario que me manden esta actividad. This is just for you to do with your classmate. This is just extra activity, but I will take some people out of this. Let me see, Brenda, I'm going to take you out. Remove. Okay, ready? One, Two, three. This is a reading activity, so just read the essay. It's a short essay. Read it together. Teacher, send me to break a room, please. Okay.
teacher. Hello, Glenda. Can you can you ask me to break a room, please? Yes. Teacher, lose connection. Okay, no problem. I will I will send you right now. Le salió ahí, ya Nari. Did you get it? Teacher, are, are, are you able to share screen? Pueden compartir pantalla? No, no, oh, teacher. Okay. Let me Would you please? Mm -hmm. Now you can, right? Yes. All right, great. Great. Thank you. No problem. Okay, let's read it by a paragraph if you are agree, girls. Great. Hello, Yanari. Yanari? Did you lose connection, Janari? I put you, I don't know if you can hear me, but I put you with the, with group number one.
if you want. Okay, Francisco. Yes, teacher. I, I. Okay, you asked for help. What, what, what is the question, Francisco? No, the, I can, the, we cannot the share the, 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 the picture. We wouldn't, but we, we can. But, uh -huh, but right now, Janari can share the, the picture. Mm, okay. Because uh, the, 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 the Zoom is, in my case, I, Zoom is showing a message that I don't know have a permission to, to share the, the picture. Okay. The same hey. case for Edwin. Okay, what about Janari? She's sharing it right here. Yes, Janari's game. Okay, so. Yes. I don't know what to say, right? Because... But I have problems with my internet. <laughs> ah, okay, so. I don't know because uh, everyone has access. Todos tienen acceso a compartir. Okay. Everyone. So I don't know why uh, Francisco and Edwin couldn't share, but good, good thing Janari could, right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Yeah, it's a solvento, right? Any, uh, you know, I thought you had a question about the activity. No, I. The instruction is maybe is to discuss the the five. Question. Yes, the the paragraphs, and then, but uh, you only have three here. Mm -hmm. Okay, so just discuss the questions and then read. Like one person reads one paragraph, the next person reads the next one and so forth, right? Okay. All right. All right. You have about maybe about six minutes. All right. Okay. All right. Yes. Thank you. Okay. Right. okay. No problem. No problem. I'm here. All right. Bye-bye. Call them best friends in 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 their first day. I mean, I they you. they don't they don't call them best friends. I mean, men are different to to girls. <laughs> I think I I think you will say is a a female because everyone was polite with her. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Maybe was a beautiful girl. Ah. <laughs> Imagine. Okay, yeah. yeah. All right. And the number five, do you think this person went um uh, went on to be successful as too? Um, sure. number, number four, do you think the writer is male or female and why? I think that the, the writer is, is male, male because, yes, I think that the, <laughs> the writer is I think that's male. true, but I don't I don't know why, because I I was thinking from the beginning that was a man. Yeah, because he told uh, he he was talking about the But let's. But that happens to well, guys too. That like, 
I have met some, let's say, some co-workers that have been, have been gross or... <laughs> yeah, no, nothing every exactly they promote it. I don't know why. And if you don't ask them uh, to to give a, to give you the points, they sometimes don't even bother to to tell you that you can. We are finished, teacher. All right, great, great. That's the reason we we're talking about the the Leal app. Okay, what do you think about Leal? Do you use it, Fabio? Mm. Yes, I use it. Oh my it's God, good. there is Subway too. <laughs> Subway, Subway too. <laughs> yeah, I love Subway. Yeah, I have a lot of uh, companies that work with Leal. Yes, yes, the um. You know what I used to like? I used to like to go to Subway at least two or three times a month, right? And I would always do the questionnaire, the survey, where you get the free cookie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> or I talk, always, or I always made the the survey, but never got the cookie. Yeah, never, never. Never ask for the cookie. Oh, I did. I love those cookies. They're good cookies. There is there is mumusu too, and I'm I'm going to chop it regularly to mumusu. <laughs> <laughs> you know that if you eat a Taco Bell, you do the survey also, and then when you finish, they give you lo, los churritos de dulce. Did you know that? No, I didn't. Yeah. 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 Every time I go to Taco Bell, I, I, I do the survey. It's online, right? And then they give you a number and you put it on your ticket and you go to the cashier and you tell them, hey, I did the survey and they give you the free, the free churro. They're uh, sweet rolls, like sweet. Have you done that, Blanca? Mm -hmm. I have do the one in Wendy's um, where they give you a, a hamburger. Mm-hmm. They do that also. Exactly. Or, or there is Santa. There is Santa Burguesa too. <laughs> <laughs> Look at Blanca. She's already looking for everything right now, right? Like, yeah. yeah but great. only on only on restaurants because that <clears throat> that it's the most that I consume. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We will go back to the main session. Okay. 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 Okay, everyone's back. Can you hear me? All right. Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay, so yes. let, let's talk about this, right? Let's talk about this. How did the student feel at the beginning of the first day at university? <laughs> Give me some adjectives. Yes, all right, very good, very, very good. I hear a lot of adjectives, very good. When did the student's first day start to improve? When did it begin to improve? When they introduce mm -hmm. themselves. 
themselves. Themselves. Very good. Yeah, Very and it's, and it's start with the and join with the activities for fresh students. Yeah, that is correct. Very good. Very good. We started interacting, right? And like, yeah, let's go do this activity. So that's when the students uh, first day start to improve. What about number three? What do you think was the best thing that happened to the student on this day? What do you think? Make uh, no. the best friends in their no. life. Yours. Uh, yes, talking about best friends, right? So it's like, yeah, let's making or meeting new friends, right? Very good, very good. Now, here's the question. Number four, do you think the writer is male or female? Do you think it's a male or female? No binary. <laughs> female. Mm -hmm. Female. Some people female. say female. Okay, I want to hear arguments. Why do you think it's a man and why do you think it's a woman or male or female? Because she made girlfriends. Okay. All right. What about for the man? Why, why, what is your argument? Teacher. Mm -hmm. Actually, in the story, it doesn't say he's a male or a female. It never says so. Uh, you could think that it's a female because actually females, most of, real, most of the time, they hang, out, they hang around together. But there's a lot of times that they, a male could be a... Uh, a lot of friendly with the female, so it's kind of tricky. Okay, all right. This is uh, this is what you call when you infer, right? When you infer something, when you try to give something that is not written, but you can infer, right? Just like Freddie said. Yeah, and what what makes what makes it more tricky is that when you see the pictures, you see in the pictures there's a male, there's a female, so. It, it makes a, a doubt in your mind. Okay. All right. All right. Anyone else? Will give an argument. It is female. Why? Because it says that they have a lot in common. Mm -hmm. All right. But if you said there's a lot in common, let's say you meet another person. Let's say you meet meet a guy. And let's say that guy comes from the same place that you're you're coming from, and he has been through the same thing that you have been through. So you have a lot of things in common, and it's a different gender. So that doesn't make it exactly a female. All right. Okay. Any more arguments? Is it a man or, a, or what do you think, Beatrice? I think it's female. Okay, so, why? Because the friends okay. are right here. So became good friends and you start cheating. Chatting, 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 right? Chateando, right? Chatting and learn more about each other. Chatting. All right. Now this is. There is no correct answer here. Although the activity says that it's most likely a woman. Es más probable que sea una mujer. So if you say woman, that, that's what the activity said, all right? The activity, as far as the answers, right? It said that it was most likely a female because of this part, like Beatriz and uh, I think it was Abigail said, right? They had a lot in common and they became good friends and we were talking about june and apple right two two girls but the argument that freddie gave is also accurate right because just like he mentioned you could meet guys right you could meet two men and say that they became good friends right so <clears throat> it could be it could be that perspective also but the book the the story has it as it's most likely a female all right but yeah critical thinking analysis number five do you think this person went to be went on to be a successful student do you think that we hope so we hope so right 
<laughs> we hope so. All right. What do you think? Anyone else that would like to express themselves? The, the paragraph doesn't say the, about the successful student. No yeah. mention. Uh, yeah, it doesn't mention. Remember that it is, it is your perspective. It is your analysis. It says, do you think? Do you think? Right? Eh, su propia opinión aquí. Your opinion. What do you think, Iris? Do you think that this person went on to be successful? Maybe because eh, she she knows a eh, good people, good 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 classmates. Right. Um, probably eh, they 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 did good work in groups. I don't know. Okay. All right. All right, very good, very good. Anyone else that would like to say something as far as number five? I think she only went the first day. <laughs> you only think she only went one day to class, huh? Just that one day and that was it, right? All right, Abigail. All right, those, that's your, your analysis, right? Remember, there's no right or wrong answers. This is just your analysis, your critical thinking, right? And I know that it's almost time. So tomorrow, let me see, tomorrow we are going to do some more of this. And for tomorrow I have this, weird jobs. Think about this weird job. Estos son trabajos de verdad, all right? And if you probably say, teacher, no, I professional mourners. No existe. Si sí existe, okay? You can look this, puede buscarlo en línea. Yeah, you, can go online. you can go online. Professional mornings are the ones that you hire. Contrata a la persona para que llore en su funeraria. <laughs> That's what they do. You see these women right here? What teacher? Yes, they pay. They cobran como 30, 150 dollars. <laughs> but they uh -huh. act, teacher. No, it's, it's true. It's, it's, it's okay. It's the field. I, I want that I, job. I, I'll, I'll, tell I'll tell you I what. I'll tell you what. I want that job. I'll tell you what. Not here in El Salvador, right? But in other parts of the world. I'll tell you what, Francisco, and those of you that probably say, teacher, I know como, como decimos, no, right? Uh, no, maybe, maybe it's true. All right. I want you to research. Do your own research, <laughs> right? I want you to go right now to Google and say professional mourner. How much do they make? I got a little bit Bye. Look for it, right? Just I give you one minute. One minute. Professional, Professional mourner. After this, we are going to receive advertising. <laughs> oh my God, it's true. Ah, ¿qué pasó, Francisco? Oh my God, it's true. This is right. ¿Cuánto ganan? How much do they make, Francisco? Can you see? Uh, Can someone? Uh, professional mourner also corner me mirologist uh, in this I don't don't know how the, the, the okay but you can because do I find I around forty to one hundred fifty per funeral. <laughs> Per funeral, right? Per funeral, right? Per funeral, right? So there you have it, Fabio. Thank you for sharing that. Tomorrow we will look at this, and then you're going to talk about which job of these. These are weird, weird jobs, okay? Son raros, right? Mm -hmm. Which job would you have? These are very common in the United States. Golf ball diver, right? Los que juegan golf, agarrame la pelota y metete en el agua, right? They go get the balls, right? So they get paid good money, good money. Right, maybe three times what we make here in the Salvador just to go pick up golf balls. All right, so tomorrow we'll look at this and then you decide which job of these would you take. All right, <laughs> <You take it. laughs> that will be for tomorrow, and then we're also going to do the speaking part where you will get in groups and talk about a job you dislike. Uh, talk about how your country will change in the next 10 years. These types of questions, right? Fun things you do in your hometown. 
a problem you overcame, your first job, the benefits of city life, those sorts of things. Superstition. Do you believe in superstition? I hear we're talking about like the CPT or the C whatever, those type of things, right? That will be for no. tomorrow. So be ready. Tomorrow is the last day uh, for this unit, basically. And I'm also going to show you the questions in the platform. So if you haven't finished or you have doubts, tomorrow will be your time to get it done. Okay? Because I have to send the grades a la medianoche by 12. I have to send your grades. So when we do the activities, ahí la puede estar haciendo usted también. All right? So be ready. The exam and the activities for tomorrow. All right, okay. so be ready. I will spend okay. about an hour on that. So if you haven't finished, please do not miss tomorrow. Porque después, ya después de las 12, I'm sorry. Right? So. Okay. Uh -huh. How many classes left after this? Okay, this, uh, when, we, when we do intermediate, this level intermediate, there are 25. 25. Son cinco semanas, five weeks. Okay, so after tomorrow, we have 10 more classes después de mañana, yes. okay? Which is 10 classes in unit three and unit four, and that's it. Unit three, five days. Unit four, five days, and we're done. Yes. We finish. I have a question. Yes, please. After intermediate four, what goes? I think it's uh, intermediate six. I mean, uh, intermediate five, okay. I'm sorry. Intermediate five. So there are six of them. Yes. Ah, okay. All right. And how many, uh, how long we have to wait for the next module? Mm, you will receive that information from administration. Mm -hmm. From administration. Okay. So after they do all the paperwork and everything, eh, I don't know si ya les mandaron el papeleo para el siguiente módulo o no. I do not know. Mm -hmm. eh, no? Todavía no? Yes. Yes. Alguien dijo que sí. Okay. Yes. No. So, uh, I don't. I yes. Have no. No. Then, uh, no. In my case, they send it to my um worker, and I I send mine too at the same time. So. Algunos de ustedes ya lo mandó. Ya lo mandó, Fred. You already sent it. Yeah. Yeah. yeah so I have no control over that. Uh, you see, I do not know of that. I know they do it, but I don't know when. Ay, pero por lo que veo, ya, ya hicieron algunos. All right. So, I see you tomorrow in the first... Oh, I have to do the final attendance. All right. Final attendance. So, tomorrow, be relaxed. Tomorrow's open class. All right. We're just going to do a little review, practice, have fun, do extra activities, y divertirnos mañana. All right. So, let me do the final attendance. Abigail. Present. All right. Beatriz. Present. Thank you, Blanca. Blanca. Present. All right, Brenda. All right, Carlos. Okay, thank you, Diana. Present. Okay, Edwin. Present. All right, thank you, Flor. Present. Okay, thank you, Francisco. Present, teacher. All right. Freddy's. I'm here. All right, great. Glenda? Present teacher. All right. Iris? Present teacher. Okay, great. Jackie? I'm here. Great. Jarvin? Present teacher. All right. Jennifer? I'm here, teacher. Okay, thank you. Juan Jose? Okay. Um, Miguel. I'm here, teacher. All right. Fabio. Present. All right. Rolando. Present. Okay. And Janari. Here. Okay, class. And the person that stays today is, let me see, Jennifer. Jennifer. Jennifer, hello, Jennifer. Hi, teacher. I'm sorry, is a... Uh, you stay tomorrow, okay? Uh, today is Jarvin. Uh, if you want, I can stay today. But uh, uh, Jarvin is today. Okay, Jennifer, tomorrow you can stay. All right. Okay. Okay, Jarvin, today is your extra 10 minutes. Okay, teacher. 
I was thinking, yo estaba mirando como la clase 15, right? I was like, no, today's class 14. So, it's charming. <laughs> All right, I was like, hey, hold on. <laughs> so, okay, class, miren, I'm going to say in Spanish, para aquellos que no terminaron las tareas en la plataforma, mañana les voy a ayudar para completarlas. Si fallan, ahí depende de ustedes, ok? Pero espero que entre y así vamos a terminar todo y no, y no va a neces necesario que le esté llamando a administración para que hagan las tareas, ok? So, I will help you tomorrow. All right. Okay, teacher. Thank okay, you. see you tomorrow. Thank you. Good. 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 Let me remove. Uh, remove Brenda right here. Okay, great. Okay, hello, Jarvin. These are your extra ten minutes. We can talk however you however you want to do this. You can ask questions, vocabulary or just anything that you have in mind. Okay, teacher. Hello. Uh, I would like to know what is the best way to improve my listening. Okay. Because I, I, I feel I have problem with that. Okay. The best way to practice listening, I can send you some activities if you want. Yes, of course. Okay, I will. Let me write that down. Okay, because I know uh, I did it for someone else. You wanted a little bit of activities. Y yo con gusto lo hago fuera de, you know, outside of the class. And I will send you good listening activities, right? So when I send you something, it's the best, right? Busco lo mejor, right? So okay, okay, thank you. Listening because, mm -hmm. just because I am trying to listen to English in English music and I start to to watch a series in English, but I feel that I, I can get it anything. I don't know why. Okay. And when I when I use the, the libraries and music and when I use the subtitle in in the series, I read and I say, oh, okay, it's easy. But when I use use when I I am use listening, it's a little bit difficult to me. Okay. One of the things <clears throat> I'm going to tell you something. When you begin listening, yes, it's good to, to look at the closed captioning, right? The closed captioning. But when you take out the closed captioning, it becomes difficult, right? Why? Because your mind has already got used to it. Ya la acostumbraste a leer, your mind. Remember that the abilities that we have, there are four for the acquirement of, of a language, son cuatro, four principles of acquisition of language. Reading, writing, listening, and speaking. Okay. But for me, for me, the most important is listening. That is the most important, is listening. And I'm going to explain to you why. When you're growing up, Jarvin, when you're growing up as, as a baby, when you were growing up, well, you see your family, your your, you see children, right? Do they talk first or do they listen first? I listen first. Exactly right. So they listen to people speak. Y yes. así como escuchan, así es como hablan, right? Even the accent, hasta el acento, right? Because you That's can even right. say, that person is not from El Salvador, that person is from Mexico, right? Because of the accent. Yes. Or that person is from Spain, Although they're speaking Spanish, but they are speaking the way they listen. All right. They listen to intonation and everything related to accent. Right. So when you hear me speak, Jarvin, can you understand me? Yes. The principal ideas, I got it. When you are talking about a, a topic that I didn't know, I got the principal ideas. Okay. So that's good. That's good. And remember this also, Jarvin. 
you're going to hear different types of English, yes. right? That is some of the dilemmas that Spanish speakers have. It's when they listen to a show or they listen to a certain type of music. Remember that music is okay to listen, but in music, grammar is incorrect. Oh, yes. They use a lot of slang, a lot of basics English, all right? They do not use academic English or what we say proper English. It's all to rhyme, al ritmo, right? So yes. it's good to listen to that, to music in English, but at the same time, you want to listen to proper English, right? Oh, yeah. And you want to listen to educational English. There is a difference, okay? Mm -hmm. There is a difference. Now, when we do listening, when you listen to shows, try to listen in American English. Okay. All right, American English, because there are two types of English. There's European or what we say British English, where the accent is a little bit different. And I'm going to give you a comparison. Salvadorian Spanish, Spain, Spaniards from uh, over yes, there, yes, right? Yes. So if you listen, even you as a Spanish speaker, when you listen to a Spaniard, you're like, a veces como que te pierdes un poquito, right? You're like, yes, but you can understand. Right. Imagine someone that does not understand Spanish and they're learning and they listen to Spaniard, and then they listen to Salvadorian Spanish, they're going to be like, hey, whoa, whoa, right? a little bit confused. Yeah, exactly. That is the same way with the English. When we as Spanish speakers start to acquire a new language, remember, uh, even in Spanish, vosotros, right? They speak differently, right? We don't talk yes. like that, right? Vuestros, right? We don't say that, right? We say nuestros, yes. right? So yes. the same thing with English. Try to use or try to focus in just one national English. In other words, one nationality. What I mean is American English. Okay, American. But sometimes teacher, sorry, sorry. But sometimes it's difficult because, for example, in my job, I have to speak with American people, and the accent for someone is a little bit difficult to understand everything that I they have told you. Okay, so listen. This is, this is also important. In the United States, even in America, even in America, there are certain regions that they speak a little bit different also, right? Like people from New York do not speak the same English as people from California, right? It might be slightly different, right? Maybe the accent, right? The New York and the Boston, those type of section of the United States versus you know, East Coast and West Coast, right? And, yes. but listening is very important, Jarvin. And I will find some good activities for you to do in listening. Remember that if you get accreditation, for example, TOEFL or TOEIC, they come with a listening activity. So I'm going to find some good activities for you. It might take me a few days. Okay, Jarvin? Okay. But okay, I will no find something good and I just send you something compromise. Right? Just to, <laughs> so I'm going to find something good for you because when people ask, I am willing to help. Okay? okay to the you. best, to the best, to the best. So continue to grow, Jarvin, and I know that you want to acquire the English language. I can feel you, right? You're you're you have the capacity, but you want more. Get a mass, you want more, right? And yes, I can yeah. tell, right? You're you're hungry for it. All right. You're hungry for it. So I'm willing to help you and I'm going to send you some activities. And then when you finish, you can send them to me and tell me uh, the answers of how you did. Like audios with evaluations. Okay. Okay. To, okay. To, to make it a little bit more challenging for you. Okay? Yes. Yes. All right, Jarvin. Okay. So thank you for staying and I'm glad you can understand me, right? <laughs> that is the good thing. That is the good thing, right? So remember, I give you American English. That's what I have, American accent. So that's what I bring to you. Okay, Jarvis? So thank okay. you for staying the extra time and continue to grow. I am proud of you, Jarvin, to okay, take you, the sir. initiative to be in class and always participate, and you're doing a great job. Okay? Okay, you're doing thank awesome you. Job. Okay, Jarvin, good night, and I will be sending you that when I have it. 
Okay. Was a pleasure, teacher. Okay, Bye. no problem. So pleasure is all mine, darling. Good night. Good night. Bye-bye.